guess what day it is it's still friday y'all but it is 4 15 on the dot and your girl just pulled out of the garage at wizard because i already y'all it's so cold it is 41 in the dc um right now but anyway um i turned in my timesheet and i didn't have enough to really s um make overtime and i have a couple errands i need to run before i go home so so I'm off um, and I got in kind of early today like 8 45 go buttons right so I have my planner here because I bring it home every Friday and I have written down in it what I need to do it just says hustle on the front I think I've shown it to you guys before but I had the same planner last year um so I have a few things to do tomorrow but today before I get home uh, or before I go home excuse me y'all it's been a week um i need to go to party city because buttons is extra and i ordered like i told you guys the nfl tableware for the um super bowl even though the girl does not do football or any sport for that matter um but anyway i just like it things to look a certain type of way you know and it's not even at my house it's at my parents house but whatever and they don't know that i ordered it but whatever so i need to go pick that up because i did i told you guys i did store pickup so that i could use my coupon code which only saved me like two dollars and fifty cents but like i said when you're a couponer at heart two dollars and fifty cents matters okay um and then i also have to go to ross which is right beside the y'all look at my snack did i show y'all this i don't know i was snacking on that at work today um, I also have to go to Ross and return my client's lamps because remember I got the bigger ones already which work out way better um, so I have to do that and then I have to stop at the grocery store to see if I can find the Kerrygold butter y'all let me tell y'all what I did so I told y'all about <laughs> the work weight loss challenge just starting on Monday so we're like legit serious now like we got all the contestants we got all the rules the money is due on Monday like we're serious $25 every person and I think we have like eight people I don't know like eight people I think anyway um so I thought it was a great idea for me to order a huge instacart grocery order of all things that I can eat on keto y'all pray for your girl because I'm about to be a bee on wheels for the next three months I can't have my snacks my carbs none of that like let me tell y'all what I ate for dinner last night and don't judge me at all I ate some shrimp ramen noodles because I can't have those <laughs> so I, I'm trying to get out all my bad stuff now I had some shrimp ramen noodles and they were so good and I had half of a bag of the sweet chili Doritos and when I say half a bag I mean the regular bag not the individual like dollar bags mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yep let me tell you where I ate it in bed mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so I feel like I have three more days of freedom before I think I got to drop um, yeah I didn't drop chocolate in my hair I'm trying to dry oh my god anyway I feel like I have three more days of freedom before I'm on this huge carb and sugar cut. Oh, and I also have to find the Instacart, uh, the grocery store that the Instacart lady went to was out of the carry go butter. So I gotta get that. But I also gotta find my coworker told me to try Truvia because I can't have sugar. Y'all. Mm, mm, mm. I think the thing is gonna kill me. Not so much the coffee, cut. I don't drink coffee anyway. But the carbs. I love pizza. I love pasta. I just love all things carbs. I love it. I like getting sandwiches. So, oh, I did tell y'all about this this morning. I told y'all it's a waste. It's making me happy. Mm -hmm. I told y'all. But work was cool today. 
I was actually really productive today. I did a lot of work. And it was a short day. We didn't have any meetings. Which was good. But yeah. I gotta clean out my car too. It's not that bad though. So yeah. I got a lot of um bacon. Thick cut bacon, real bacon. I got a ton of eggs. Um, I got some strawberries, just has like a snack sometimes. Um, I got gra ground beef, ground turkey, a huge pack of chicken legs, a huge pack of chicken wings, two bags of frozen wingettes. I gotta get an air fryer, y'all, seriously. Um, and I also purchased some of the Hidden Rally hidden valley ranch um seasoning packs to season like some of my meats with because so i've been seeing that on youtube too i was wondering how people just ate ground meat as their protein source without it being spaghetti or in a taco or something like that and it's because they're seasoning what they're seasoning it with it actually tastes good so i i purchased some taco seasoning packets i purchased some um hidden valley ranch seasoning packets which i heard are good on burgers so i may make some burger patties i got some sharp cheddar cheese i got swiss cheese i got cheddar cheese sticks and pepperonis for a snack um i'm gonna i don't know about other fruits i mean i got some strawberries just as a little snack but i gotta be careful with the fresh fruits because of the sugars in it so i gotta be careful with that i also have to pick up some um ketone strips the test strips to show if you're in ketosis or not i need to pick up some of those um what else did i get i got a lot of veggies although i gotta get some fresh um giant has the veggies i don't know if you guys have this in your grocery stores wherever you are but they have like in the fresh produce section they have containers full of like chopped fresh veggies or whatever but giant in my area has um combinations in the same container so they'll have like asparagus tips um mushrooms and red onions that one is really really good i love that one they'll have the fajita blend um and i'll slice up sausages and eat that they'll have which has like the red onions and all the different bell peppers um i have had broccoli i think and carrots the stir fry blend or whatever and it's just really easy because it's already fresh you just throw it in a pot or whatever so i need to get a couple of those but i'll probably get those on sunday since we're starting on monday but i got some of the horseshoe beef sausages mm -hmm. um what else did i get i don't know i got some of the two liter drinks um juices and sodas and stuff for the super bowl that's what my parents house though. Um, but I'm just lazy. I don't like to go to the other store. Even though I gotta go on Sunday anyway, I could have got that out the store. But they were on sale for 99 cents, so I got those. Um, what else did I get? I feel like I got other stuff. It was only 28 items, whatever that was. But I was really bummed that they were out of the carry go butter, so I gotta stop and get some of that because I really wanna try it. That butter is five dollars. Oh my goodness. So yeah, I'm going to have to try to figure out a way to make smoothies. I think what I see on YouTube is people using coconut milk in their smoothies. I don't know if I'm going to like that. Um, so I don't know, but I've seen people put a couple of berries and spinach in like their coconut milk or whatever. But I don't know. I have to figure that out as well. Oh, it is freezing. Jeez. Um remember what else I purchased I didn't purchase hardly anything else and that was a hundred and some dollars like it's expensive oh I, I thin sliced pork chops yeah I got some of those hopefully that's keto friendly I think it is that's protein right the thing I had the problem with is finding the ground meats that are more fat because a lot of them were just lean like that's what the stores I guess that's considered more healthy which I understand that but it was really hard to find it so I just got what they had and I'll just add some I don't know butter or what I don't know 
but anyway yeah I'm excited to come up with some recipes and stuff like that um, I think the key is going to have to be meal prepping which means Sundays I'm not gonna be able to hang out at my parents house all night basically um, so we'll see I, I feel like if I can make like three meals and that will carry me through like Wednesday lunch and dinner I'll be okay for breakfast I had to get rid of my bagels y'all my bagels with my extra cream cheese y'all know but it's love bagels with extra cream cheese just the plain bagel and the plain cream cheese I had to get rid of it so I didn't order any more of that I ordered like I said a lot of bacon and a lot of eggs so um, I think some days I'll have boiled eggs and some days I'll have fried eggs but that's what it is gonna have to be now I don't like my eggs to be warmed up so I don't know, at first I was thinking about batch cooking some of them for like the first two days or, you know, two days at a time, but I don't like my eggs warmed up. I like them fresh, so, and I don't get up early enough to cook myself breakfast, breakfast, so, I don't know um, how that's going to work, but yeah, that's what your girl did. I ordered my keto groceries, at least to get me started for the first, like, week or two. for some coaching after I try this on my own for a little bit we'll see how it goes but yeah this weekend all bets are off I'm eating any and everything buttons once I might even order pizza tonight because I'm about to be not having it for a very long time so yeah I will talk to you guys later bye the NFL stuff I did a pickup store order so my stuff is going to be probably at the front or wherever that um, section is in the store. But I just wanted to show it to you. So I am trying to find it. Y'all, I can never work at a place like this. My house will be full of it. Let's see. I don't know where it is. Where is all the NFL stuff? I think this is like the wedding. I don't see it, y'all. I saw some sports stuff in here, but I don't know if it's... So they have this stuff. But this isn't the NFL. The rest of the NFL stuff. I don't know where it is, y'all. Do y'all see it? Am I missing it? I see that all of this stuff is football stuff oh that's cute look at that infladium <laughs> that's cute they have of course they have all the redskin stuff because i'm in the dmv maybe the nfl i mean the um not the nfl because this is all the nfl stuff so if you're ever looking for nfl stuff they have pretty much almost all the teams here which is pretty cool um maybe they put it up front I don't see the Super Bowl stuff. That's what, I, that's what I meant to say. I kept saying NFL. <sighs> this store is so expensive. Y'all. Mm. Let me see where it is. It said they were like fully stocked on stuff. So they have to have it somewhere up here. Let's see. Not here. Last 
do, do, do. You guys, I don't see it. Hmm. Where would they have put it? Oh, look guys, I walk right past it. This is the Ram stuff, but it's not the stuff that says Super Bowl. You see the Rams stuff here and the red and blue stuff for Patriots. So it's got to be here somewhere. Here's all the Patriots stuff. But I don't see the NFL. Oh, I see the jumbo sign. But I don't need that. So it must be over here. Yeah. I walked right past it. <coughs> so I have the plates, the napkins, and let's see. These are the tablecloths right here. I got one of those, and then we got one of these cups as well. So let me go pick that up. Look at this table runner. That is so cute. $30. That's expensive. Oh, yeah. These are the, um, the plates that I got. And they are $4.49 for 18 of them. And then I got some of the regular luncheon napkins as well. So let me go find the pickup. I'm going to pick up. And I will talk to you guys later. Now look at my dinner. I'm not playing. I told y'all. Last three days of food freedom is on. Good morning, guys. It is February the 2nd, and I just made me some two fried eggs, some sharp cheddar cheese, and three sausage links. So I'm getting ready with the keto stuff with the fried egg and the cheese. The sausage links are maple, so I don't think I can have those on keto. But again, it doesn't start till Monday. I'm also having the last bit of my peach tea. And I got these from Ross last night when I returned those lamps for my client because I had these last week and they were good. So I need to get these in before Monday. And then I'm burning champagne toast by Bath and Body Works. It's so good. And I usually don't like the sweet scents like that, but it's really, really good. So I'm going to eat my breakfast and then I got to go find some curtains. I have to go to the bank. The curtains are for my client's master bedroom. I have to go to the bank. And then I have a therapy appointment today. And I think Harper and Stacy need to come over to use the printer. So that's what my day is consisting of. So I will talk to you guys a little later after I eat my breakfast. Hey y'all, it's still Saturday, January the 2nd. I'm at the nail salon so I can get my eyebrows done. Y'all pray that Amy is in here. I tried to go to the ATM. Oh my goodness. I hate going to a particular bank on a particular day or time of the month because it's like a zoo in there. I couldn't even get the transaction I wanted done. I just wanted to use the ATM and they wouldn't even let me do that. They done broke the ATM and so many people. So I'm gonna have to go to another branch after I get this done. It's 125, I got a therapy appointment in one hour. So I'm about to walk up in here and get these caterpillars done. Y'all, I left my brush and my hair scarf in my car last night and I was too lazy to go outside and get it. So I wrap my hair with my fingers and I use the bonnet instead of my hair scarf. So I said I want these in my hair. So yeah, bear with me. Lordy. But anyway, what y'all doing this weekend? Y'all got Super Bowl parties going on. I ordered the chicken from Lido's. The chicken wings from Lido's that are supposed to be bringing to my parents' house. I forgot to uh, put the plates and stuff in my car. I was going to drop those off today, but I guess I could just bring them tomorrow. I told my mom I got them, so. Okay. Y'all, why I went in the, in the bank with my bonnet on? I forgot to take it off. I was wondering why people was looking at me like I was crazy. But, um, anyway, I'm about to run in here and get these eyebrows done if Amy's in here. better right y'all it is like 4 403 it has been a few hours since i um last got off with y'all and i told y'all i was going in to get my brows done i went in to get my brows done 
and Amy was like, oh, can you come back at five? I said, no, but I can come back at four because my therapy's over at 3.30. So I was like, I'll come back at four. She was like, okay. So I went to therapy. Well, first I went to Wegmans to look for that Kerrygold butter and it's like looking for a unicorn. I can't find it anywhere. Don't know where it is. So anyway, I instead got some lunch from the hot food bar, sat down in Wegmans to eat it. And I also got, look y'all, y'all know I got my favorite before. This weight loss challenge starts. I feel like I'm gonna put on 10 pounds before it starts. Look what I got, y'all. Wegmans cupcakes. <sighs> Anywho, I went in there for Kerrygold butter, not for these, but I ate lunch and stuff in there. And then I went to therapy, and then I came back here, and she was ready for me. And she was like, oh, you're only getting your brows done? I said, yeah. And she was like, oh, I told you to come back earlier um or told you to come back later earlier because i thought you were getting your feet and your nails done too and i knew i was going to be a while with my you know the client that she was doing at the time and i was like no i said i just wanted my brows done so yeah i could have got them done earlier but it's okay um so i went to the bank i went to therapy got my brows done three things i wanted to do now i'm headed to Bowie to go to Michael's because I have to get some flowers for uh, my client's bedroom and they are having I think 40% off florals plus an additional 20% off so I better get it today I, think, I don't know I may go see my, my niece Mia, but I'm going to see her tomorrow so I don't know I don't know what I'm going to do though I need to look for some curtains for my client as well but the only place I usually have luck with curtains, honestly, is Home Goods and Home Sense. I have not had any luck anywhere else with curtains. I did order some from Kohl's before. Yeah, but other than that, and I haven't really looked online for curtains for my client because I kind of want to see the pattern in the shade in person so I'm trying not to do the whole online thing if I don't have to but we'll see y'all know y'all see I got all of my new cures earrings that I got from Target mm -hmm. I put on some lipstick today I may try to uh beat my face a little bit for tomorrow for the first Super Bowl since I got my brows done you can't tell me nothing now these things those things was looking horrible whoa but anyway, I need to go up here and get these flowers and then make my way back home because I know Stacy and Harper are trying to come over so she can work on her project and print some stuff out. Y'all, they putting up housing everywhere in the DMV, like in the middle of the freaking highway. They're putting up a townhouse community. What the heck? <coughs> Excuse me. Y'all, I have been eating this bag of Sour Punch little bites. Yeah, I know I had a bag last week, too. I need to stop. I think I'm going to give it to Benny tomorrow when I go to my mom's house. He had a good tutoring session today and last week, so I'll give him those. I don't need to eat no more because I am going to eat one of these cupcakes. And y'all better believe it. Um, so, yeah, I think that's all I needed to do. I need to look at my planner in a minute. But my therapy session was good. It was good to see her. I hadn't seen her in a while. about this weight loss challenge look at my neck and i used to be so skinny like in school oh lord let's say oh, um let me tell y'all what i need and i shouldn't even tell y'all because i know y'all gonna go off in the comment section please don't i already i'm aware of it i need to get some breaks immediately like seriously i keep putting it off but i need to go is that serious now what did i need to do go to the atm go to therapy oh i need to order this stuff for my clients too but i'll do that i ordered the wings for tomorrow i returned the lamps i picked up my party city order i did my time sheet y'all i'm on the road changed my homeowner's insurance already i'm on the road Close that close about this week. Very good. So anyway, that's all I wanted, y'all. And from Wegmans, you know they have the hot food bar in there. I actually really like Wegmans and I never hardly go in there. But anyway, I went in there and I got some lemon 
pepper wings. I got one Old Bay wing, which was really salty to me. Um, my cousin Courtney told me to try their crab mac and cheese. So I tried that. That was really good. I got a little bit of greens and a little bit of like their Singapore rice noodles with shrimp, which I didn't care for, but I did eat the shrimp. And I just got like a little teeny bit because it was $9.99 a pound and mine didn't even come. Mine came to like $7 because the cupcakes were 5 and my total was $12 and some change. So I didn't get that much at all. Again, it was just for lunch. I'm working on portion um, control and I just needed to kill some time before my therapy appointment. So yeah, I got I ate lunch. A little lunch to myself. That was that was good. And then I went to therapy and went to get these brows tamed. And yeah, so I don't know what I'm gonna do after I leave Bowie. I really don't feel like going to Home Goods. Can y'all believe that? But I really need to find some drapes for this room. So I may go to Home Goods. We'll see. Um but other than that, that's about all that's on the agenda today. So I will talk to you guys a little bit later. Saturday it's 5 49 I just left home goods at Marshall's because I was looking for some stuff for a client and I went to Michael's I just needed some white roses to cut down and put in that mother of pearl for my client's dresser that I hauled for you guys and then and I don't think I put it in the hall but the dresser she got the same dresser that I have which is the Hayworth dresser from Pier 1 but she got it on Facebook Marketplace as well I think I've told you guys that before and as you guys know I said this in my IG stories today while I was in the store but to glam up any piece of furniture all you do is change the knob so I got two of these these were $14.99 from from home goods they also had the door knobs as well which i have for my house for my door and my bathroom door i just haven't installed them yet but yeah i got her two packs of these because that dresser has nine drawers um instead of six so because there's three small ones across the top and then three going down on both sides so i had to get two packs of these and i was not successful at finding any curtains so that's a bummer but I'll keep looking for those. And now I think I'm on my way home. It's 5.50 now, guys. But other than that, they didn't really have much. I was looking for some stuff in, for my um, built-ins because I want to film a how to style your built-in shelving unit um, for you guys. But I pretty much have my shelves styled. They're pretty much styled. And that's how I'm, <coughs> excuse me, that's how I'm going to leave them. Um for a, a while um but when i took down the garland from christmas under my tv in my mantle area it just looks so bare so i put two candle holders there but that's all i have so i was looking for more like pieces to put on there just to you know but they didn't have anything in either store so i don't want to just buy anything that i don't like so i um I, I don't I didn't buy anything so I'm waiting to film that video because I don't have anything to put right there yet and I'm pretty sure if I shop my home I can find stuff but I don't want it to be random stuff like maybe I need to think of a vision for right there and then I'll know when I see it but I don't know y'all I'm about to eat me one of these cupcakes though but that's all she wrote for today guys um, I am probably gonna go home I may take a bath tonight like a bubble bath I don't know we'll see but I will talk to you guys a little later bye hey guys so it's Sunday January the 3rd um, it is 9 52 and I'm about to get off of here with you guys and stream church or maybe I can stream online I mean on my my TV I don't know but I wanted to show you guys I'm about to make me some breakfast and get my kitchen together because it's a mess but I wanted to show you show you guys some of the stuff that I got for this keto journey that I think I'm about to do. Well, I know I'm about to do it because of my weight loss challenge at work. Um, and excuse this, I just woke up. So this is some of the stuff I got. This is not everything. So let me turn the camera around and show okay, you Okay, so I got some grapes and some strawberries just for snacking. Um, yeah, and then for another snack, I got some pepperoni because it doesn't have any carbs in it at all. 
as you can see. And then I got some extra sharp cheddar cheese. And cheese, I think, does have carbs in it. Oh, no, it doesn't, actually. There's no carbs in this either. So I'm going to put some pepperonis and a stick of cheese in some sandwich bags. Let me actually grab some sandwich bags, you guys. I just bought some from Dollar Tree. So I'll bag those up. And my mom told me I can also eat pork rinds, so I'm going to get some of those. But some of the meats I got, I got some thin sliced um, pork chops. I like to put these on the George Foreman grill. So I'm just going to thaw these out and season them. And then the night that I want them, I'll throw them on the grill because that's super quick. I got a family pack of whole chicken wings. So I think I'm going to do lemon pepper with these. I also got a bag of the party wingettes. Those are frozen. But I'm trying not to do all three types of chicken. Um at one time so i think i'm gonna do some of the whole wings um and then i also have some chicken drumsticks a party pack of those i'm, I'm i brought some ranch let me see what there is some of the ranch seasoning oh goodness gracious hold on guys i bought some of this stuff to try to season this is for the ground meats that i purchased i got some taco seasoning just to um, season that up with but i also bought the uh four pack of these ranch seasonings so i'm gonna try to season my drumsticks with that i have to go to the store to find some Kerrygold butter because they were out of it when they delivered my food and then of course i got bacon for breakfast and I actually have an 18 pack of eggs. I need to refill these. Um, so I think I'm going to boil some eggs, just a few, maybe like four. And then I'll also scramble some eggs and cook some bacon for the night before or something. Because I don't want to cook too much bacon and then it not be, you know, whatever. Good. Um, this is just food that I'm going to trash, basically. So I think this is what I'm going to prep. I also have salad stuff. Um, and then I have some salmon that was already cooked. That's just my um, craft bin, right? Craft bin on the go because Harper was over here yesterday doing her project. Um, but I have some salmon that was already cooked. So I don't know. I'm thinking about maybe eating a little piece of salmon with some eggs this morning. I'm hungry. Um, and then I have, I brought some Sargento cheeses. I also have Parmesan cheese as well. I brought, um, excuse me, I brought some of these because I like to saute these in a pan with fresh, fresh vegetable blends. So I'm going to get some of those from the store. And then down there is where I have all of the kale and the salad and stuff. I also ordered a ton of, here's more bacon, more thin sliced pork chops. That's ground beef. This is the party wings, the chicken. I also have a ground turkey right there. Um and a lot of steamed veggies i couldn't throw away the bread but whatever and i also have some diced chicken strips and stuff so yeah i don't know where these turkey pot pies came from but whatever and more steamed veggies down there so i think i'm good on the steamed veggies so yeah i am going to get started cleaning my fruit packaging up my snacks portioning out my meats and cooking me some eggs to go with some of this salmon so i will talk to you guys later i'm about to stream in church guys so snack one is done i put two sharp cheddar sticks of cheese and then just i portioned out the pepperonis so that made let's see six bags so that's good i'm gonna put these in there's only a couple left in here i'll just eat those but yeah i think this is a good snack and now <clears throat> excuse me I am going to start on the fresh fruit and clean that up as well. Okay, guys, so I have finished my little fruit concoction. I have red and green grapes that I've washed, and then I washed and have some strawberries, some fresh strawberries. So that's good. Also, I have to pick up some pork rinds for a snack. That'll be my third snack. And then one of my coworkers told me to grab some stevia because I can sprinkle that on some of the strawberries. I want to show you guys that I finally broke down and got a cutting board because you guys know I was using a plate, which is ridiculous. But yeah, I got a cutting board when I was in Home Goods last week. So yeah, this is my salad, my fruit salad or snack fruit. And I don't know if I showed you guys this, but um, somebody else that does keto, I follow her, Sheena Sells Houston on IG. She had mentioned something about Spicy Ranch. And I'm assuming this is the brand she got, so I wanted to try it. 
and we'll see. I also got a regular ranch just in case I don't like it, but we'll see. And so now, I don't know what I'm going to do. What am I going to do, guys? I had to take out some of more of my, my big containers because I'm not used to meal prepping. So I have this one and I have this one as well. I think I'm about to season some of these meats. I don't know. And see, that's the thing. Like for lunch tomorrow, I think I'll have food from my parents' house because we're going to have like a ton of wings. So I can just do wings from there and then one of the steamed veggies. But I don't know. And I have, um, I think they're in here. I might have left a lot of them at my mom's house, but I have a lot of the meal prep containers and stuff in there. So, yeah. But I think what I'm going to do is season up some of the chicken. I have to let this thaw, and I'm letting a sausage thaw as well. And then, yeah, that's what I'll do. So, we'll see. I will talk to you guys later. Bye. So I have eight eggs boiling right now. I'll probably scramble my eggs for the morning, the night before, if I want scrambled eggs, because I don't like those sitting in the refrigerator for a long time. Look at all the dishes I gotta do. I took them out of the sink, so I just need to put them in the dishwasher. Okay, so I have decided, oh, I'm about to boil my bacon. Um, that's a whole pack of bacon. And then, so I found these in my season cabinet. I forgot I bought them. So this one is a mesquite. I had another one, tomato, basil, and garlic, but I didn't have any white wine or white vinegar. So I couldn't make that one, but these just call for water and oil. So I'm gonna make half of a pack of these wings because this is a four pound pack and the season pack is only for two pounds. So I'm gonna make half of that. I'll probably add a few extra seasonings as well. And then um, I like the Sasson Goya. So I'll probably do um i don't know like five um drumsticks with this and some other seasoning i also sometimes sprinkle on chicago steak season on my chicken and then i'll probably do like five or six in these with the, the ranch dressing as well and just some other you know seasonings as well and then i think that's going to be all the meat that i'm going to prep for right now i have these things thawing so this is my ground turkey i'm going to probably make that once it thaws and put some taco season on it once this thaws i'm not going to do anything but leave it in the fridge because i can slice this and saute it with fresh vegetables that's a quick meal and then these i will probably season and just put them back in the fridge um because i put these on the george foreman and that's another quick um cooking meal during the week so that's where i'm at right now and i'm going to go back to streaming church while i food prep <laughs> okay guys time check it is 11:07. church was amazing it was about faith and had what faith means and having faith in god and how faith is a requirement for god um and it was just really really good our pastor pastor john um jenkins of first baptist church of glen arden is in my opinion one of the best i love him so anyway i wanted to show you guys that i warmed up some of that salmon and made myself two scrambled eggs and put a little bit of cheddar cheese on them i have boiled eight um hard-boiled eggs they are cooling in cold water these things are still thawing my turkey ground turkey for my taco um seasoning and then my beef sausage for my vegetable like stir fry and then also my thin cut pork chops but i made i have seasoned the ranch um chi chicken drumsticks so those are ready to go in the fridge i did the um mccormick mesquite marinade it said to reserve two tablespoons for basting so i did that um and this smells really really good of course i added a couple extra seasonings but those are some wings that i did and then i cooked a whole thing of bacon and i didn't cook it all the way crispy just because i probably have to microwave it in the morning so i didn't want it to like taste burnt so i did take it out and i let that cool so yeah that's what I have been doing. Like I said, a lot of my veggies are the steam kind. So I'll steam them and season them and then put them right in my lunch containers whenever I bake the chicken and everything else. So now I just have to clean this kitchen. I didn't make too much of a mess, but these are all the seasonings plus those two that I use. So I'm about to sit down and have some breakfast. I also have some tea, which I don't think I can have this because of the sugars in it. Let me actually check that. I know I can't, so let's see. 17 carbs, whoa, 17 sugars, 
whoa, I can't have this anymore. So I'll probably take it to my mom's house um, today so that they can drink it. And I'm just going to stick with water and I'm gonna get some lemon juice because I think I can put lemon juice and Truvia in water and that would be like lemonade. So I am about to eat this breakfast, salmon and eggs and have a little bit of tea. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. Probably watch some YouTube videos and then um, I'll start cleaning the kitchen once I'm done. Hey y'all, so I made it to my, what? Nikki bought you some lemon lemon pepper. Okay. Um, so I finally made it over here. So we're trying to set up the table. This is all my party stay stuff right here. Wait, And, okay. So I got the plates, the napkins, the cups in the back. We have, this obey wings from Lido's buffalo wings there's another tray of each over there I have wawa subs a fruit platter my mom is actually warming up some Lido's pizza right now from the oven we have some wing stock we have paisano's pizza and french fries so yeah we're trying to set everything up we got more subs right here we're just putting it out as we need it basically and then some drinks are over there and the alcohol is in the basement with my dad in the theater room. All the kids and stuff are playing over there. And yeah, so did a little bit of slight beat on my face today. Decided to use some of my makeup. So yeah, I think the game is supposed to be coming on soon, but I don't watch football, so I'm not watching it, but yeah. And I think that's it. Got juices for the kids and stuff. So yeah, that's it. This is my last day of eating carbs, so I'm going to indulge. I got some lemon pepper wings right here too. From Wingstop. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I'll catch y'all later in a little bit.